While chasing the North African Audad here in Texas can be a good time, it's rewarding, it's a challenging hunt. You should know that the Audad has more of an impact on this landscape than just providing good times and sheep meat for hunters. Namely, the introduction of the North African Audad can have serious, deleterious effects on our efforts to bring back our own native bighorn sheep. Because they are sensitive to many human-induced environmental problems, bighorns are considered to be excellent indicators of overall land and wildlife health. In other words, the presence of bighorns on a landscape is emblematic of that landscape being intact and viable. On the other hand, a landscape that once had bighorn sheep and no longer does is considered to be in some way degraded or not intact. At the time of European contact, there were as many as two million bighorn sheep, including five subspecies, the Rocky Mountain, Desert, California, Sierra Nevada, and Audubon. They range as far north as British Columbia, and they range south down into Texas and Mexico. But the animals were nearly wiped out across their range. They were killed off by unregulated hunting for meat. They were killed off to reduce competition with wool-producing sheep, and whole herds of them were carried off by introduced Asiatic and European diseases. By the early 1900s, they were nearly gone. The Audubon subspecies had gone completely extinct. In West Texas, an estimated herd of about 1,500 bighorns had been reduced to a mere 150. Thankfully, we were able to reverse these trends. Many Western states began temporary, but very strictly enforced prohibitions against sheep hunting. A lot of money was spent moving sheep from areas where they had stable populations into an area where they had few or none. Here, the Texas Parks and Wildlife Department has performed a near miracle. Today, bighorns have rebounded to their pre-settlement levels. But that doesn't mean we can sit back and relax and congratulate each other. Because while bighorn sheep have recovered to the point where they can support very limited hunting, they still face many threats. In Texas, one of those threats happens to be the introduction of the Audad sheep. Not only do Audad compete for food and resources with bighorns, but they also pose the threat of introducing viral and bacterial diseases that could decimate bighorns. If you want to find out more about bighorn recovery in Texas and what you can do to help, visit the website of the Texas Parks and Wildlife Department.